you're doing good. In this video, I will be showing you how to create bundle deals on Shopify. The first thing you will need to do after adding products to your Shopify store, you are going to go over to the left hand menu option and you are going to tap on apps. After selecting apps, I want you to tap on app and sales channel settings. From here, you are going to tap on Shopify app store in the top right hand corner. Once you have done that, I want you to tap on the search bar at the top of the page and you are going to type in bundles. After doing that, you can see that there are numerous apps that you can choose from. And the app that I recommend you use is none other than Bundler. And the reason why I recommend this app is it is highly rated as you can see it has a 4.9 star ratings. And by scrolling down, you can see that they offer a free plan that will allow you to set up unlimited bundles, customizable widget, and so much more. So we are going to tap on install. After tapping on install, you'll be redirected to a new page and you are going to tap on install once more. Once you have installed the app, you will be redirected to the app dashboard. Okay, so once on this dashboard, all you'll need to do now is tap on create bundle. After you have done that, you can see the different options that you have. So you have the classic bundle, which would allow you, for example sake, to add two products and then from there you will be able to offer a discount or a special price if persons were to buy both products. You can also offer volume discount, which is for example as you can see right here, once someone purchases an item in bulk, you will be able to offer them a discount. The other features are currently locked, so you would need to go onto their paid plan to use it. For this example, we'll be using the classic bundle. So you're going to tap right there. Then you can change the bundle name if you want. And you could also edit the title, but I'll leave it as is. Then you can scroll down and from there you could change also the call to action button if you want right there. Once everything is to your liking, you can see right here bundle status. You want to ensure that it is set as active. You can scroll down and you can set the percentage that you would like to give off. So let's say for example, we would like to give 15% off. If it is a case that you would like to give a fixed amount off, you can do that. Or if you would like to offer a fixed bundle price, you can also do that right there. If it is a case that you would like to offer free shipping, if you are on the paid plan, you'll be able to offer that. Now, all we'll need to do is tap on select products. Then from here, you can select the products that you would like to combine. So let's say, for example, this product and also this one right here. So we are going to be combining both products. Then you are going to tap on add. After tapping on add, you are going to tap on save bundle in the top right hand corner. Once the bundle has been saved, you are going to go back. Then from there, you can see that we have created our first bundle as you can see right there. Now all you need to do, you could tap on view online store from the left hand menu option. Then from there, you could scroll down and I'm going to select the product page. And all you need to do is scroll down and you're going to see it right below the mock-up images as you can see right here. So you can see how it looks. So get a discount by these products together and get a discount. So once they tap on add to cart, they'll be able to add both products at once. Another thing that you can also do by going back into Bundler, for example, you can go over to the left hand menu option and you can tap on settings and from there, you can also edit different features. So you can see right here, show bundles on product pages. You could hide that if you want. You can also scroll down and you can edit whether you would like to show the product prices and so on, as you can see right here. So there are numerous features that you can also quickly edit. You can also build bundle landing pages and so on. But for majority of these features, you will need to be on the paid plan to use them. But on the free plan, you'll be able to use the classic bundle builder. And that's it. Hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe 